eight years of CDO Portugal. Congratulations. It's so exciting to see that a large part of those eight years, Apps for Good has also been impacting young people, educators and volunteers in Portugal. I would have never thought that Portugal is the second um, important country for Apps for Good to reach young people. Um, and it's great to see not only the breadth, but also the depth of impact um, the team in Portugal has created. My favorite movie is Ratatouille. And there is the conclusion of the movie at the end to say not everyone has great talent, but great talent can come from anywhere. And if you've been attending the awards of Apps for Good in Portugal over the years, you would see that that is definitely true um, for Apps for Good Portugal and for CDI Portugal. There have been so many amazing young people, there have been so many amazing educators with the support of the Ministry of Education, with the support of corporates who've been growing and evolving. And that is great to see. Obviously, the pandemic is a challenge now, and we all know that the curriculum has been narrowed. There's been a struggle doing things online, doing things remotely. But what the team in Portugal has done is to keep doing what they're doing best, and that is to keep innovating, to keep finding for new solutions for problems they didn't encounter before, to support people um, who need their help, whether they're educators, their students, their volunteers, and to try to take things to the next level. I'm also really excited to see that now Portugal and the UK are actually working quite closely together on evolving the model of Apps for Good, on taking things to the next level. And I'm sure there will be new things coming out for young people in Portugal, not only on apps, IoT and machine learning, but also on other things. And I very much hope that there will be many more years of Apps for Good running in Portugal to contribute to the evolution of the education system. And I'm sure you know that Portugal is actually playing quite an important role within the OECD, within debates about education policy on how to really take education to the next level. Um, and I'm very much hoping that Apps for Good and as a nonprofit, we can make a contribution to that and we can continue to do that, um, accelerating innovating in a space that um, is needed to serve the needs of educators and young people in Portugal. So congratulations on what you've achieved. I'm sure with the team you've got, with Jao, with Matilda, with Priscilla, with um, everyone else who's been engaged and involved over the last few years, there will be many more great and exciting things to come. And, and I'm quite amazed that, you know, founding something takes on a separate life and keeps running even when I'm not so much involved nowadays. So it's, it's, it's great to see and it's lovely to see your energy. And if I can do something, I'll always be there to support you.